Hello buddy, welcome to another quick video. Um, it should be a very quick one today, but we've actually just stopped off at uh, Modsel Head on the way back from a park that we did last night at Bugsworth Basin. Um, and come to the car park here, mainly because we want to stop at Hobbs Cafe uh, for cake. Now I'm going to put a link to where they are down below, the what three words and a Google Maps link. Um, the cake is astounding, but that's an aside. Anyway, um, decided to park a bit and it's pay and display or pay by app. Now I tend to use the apps more than anything, so I thought I'd do a quick rundown why I use it and how much easier it is. Yeah, one of the big things that I found sort of fairly early on when we sort of got the van is when we were going to places, a lot of the time we wouldn't actually have sort of the right change for parking or sort of enough change to park up and stuff like that. But most of the places that we tend to go have actually got pay by app, which is really handy. Because uh, as long as you've got phone signal, you can pay on that. And the real handy bit is a lot of them you can actually extend your parking without actually getting back to your van. Uh, so if you sort of park up, say, an hour and you decide, oh, actually, I'm going to spend a bit longer there, you can actually extend via your phone. And you're not sort of racing back to the, uh, the van to stick another ticket on, uh, which is something I did find once in Keswick and it looked hightailing it right the way across the town centre of Keswick just to put another hour on. Um, since that's sort of updated using the apps, it's not a problem. Pick up the phone and uh, you're off straight away. Extend, you don't really worry about it. It's, yeah, it's actually quite a lot easier. So it does mean you can actually get to different car parks and a lot of the time I'll sort of have a bit of a look in the area, see if there's car parks that you can sort of pay by app. Because uh, I do find it a lot easier. Um, sometimes you, you pay maybe sort of 30p more on your sort of initial payment, uh, but for me the convenience to be able to head away from the van and not worry about having to hightail it back to actually get a new ticket on um, actually works out quite well like at the minute. Park just over there, um, the cafe that we went to, just up there. Um, this car park's maximum of an hour, hour and a half, sort of overnight. Um, it is literally a short stop, so you can have a look at. If I'm not worried about it. Down, but down there is uh, Monsell Viaduct, uh, so best look a viewing point and sort of stop off. There is a Monsell Head um, car park just a little bit further around, uh, but that is absolutely always rammed. Uh, this one, be a short stay, don't tend to be too much in there. Uh, but yeah, is it something that you've sort of considered using the apps to park up? Um, I, mean, I know some places you can actually do sort of the overnight parking as well via the app, uh, which is really handy. Um, there are a lot of machines now you can pay by card but using the app I just find it really convenient. So, is it something you considered? Let us know, drop us a comment down below. Uh, but for now, like I say, this is short and sweet, just want to sort of put that out there, give a bit of, sort of, bit of, sort of conversation with you. But yeah, give us a like, give us a sub, and we'll see you again next time. Take care.